Ahoy mateys and welcome to another tutorial on setting up Sega Model 2 on LaunchBox. Arr. This will also show you how to set up Sega Model 2 light gun games with a Demule shooter in LaunchBox. Before we get started, smush the like button, double pump the subscribe button, and step on the bell for future video notifications. Let's get started with downloading Sega Model 2, link provided below. After downloading, extract the contents to a new folder called Sega Model 2. Now we need to download Demule Shooter. Just like before, after the download is complete, extract the contents to a new folder called Demule Shooter. See download link below. If you don't already have LaunchBox installed, I will provide a link below. Inside the Demule Shooter folder, open Demule Shooter underscore GUI execute and set up your light guns, then save. If you have a second light gun, you can click the drop down arrow and select player 2 configuration and map the second light gun. Make sure to set up both light guns inside of the Ultimark software. See link below for instructions. You'll also need to create a BAP file for each game in LaunchBox to load through Demule Shooter. For example, create a new notepad document and call it HOTD, which stands for House of the Dead. Open the document and type the provided lines. Save as a .bat file. Open your Sega Model 2 folder and create a new folder called ROMs. You will place all your zip ROMs in this location. Now it's time to set up the Sega Model 2 on LaunchBox. Open LaunchBox, go to Settings, Tools, Import, ROM files. Next, add files and navigate to your ROMs folder. Select all your ROMs and click open. Next, for platforms for importing games, click the drop down arrow and select Sega Model 2. Next, for Choose an Emulator, click on Add. Browse to your Sega Model 2 folder and select Emulator underscore multi CPU dot execute. Make sure all your settings look like mine and then click OK. Select the used files in their current location and click Next. Next, 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 and then select finish. To set up light guns on LaunchBox, locate a game, right click, and select edit. Under additional apps, click the applications. Type Demule Shooter for the application name. Under Application Path, browse to the BAT file you created inside of your Demule Shooter folder and open. Make sure to automatically run before Main Application checkbox is checked. And then click OK. OK. For setting up BAT files for the games, I will provide a URL to Demule Shooter's command line page. This will provide all the necessary information needed for setting up each light gun game. Also, before we start a game, we will need to set up the controls. Open your Sega Model 2 folder and double click the emulator underscore multi CPU execute. Go up to the emulator and then load ROMs. 
Run the game you want to change your control settings on. Remember, you have to load the game first before changing the controls. Now go up to the game and then select Configure Controls. You can change all your control settings in this location. If you want to set up multiple light guns for this emulator, you will need to open emulator.ini file and locate the use raw input and change it to 1. Also make sure your Demule Shooter program has both Player 1 and Player 2 set up correctly for each light gun. You'll need to change this setting back if you want to change any other game controls. If you don't, you will not be able to select the tabs at the top of the settings for your controls. This can be a little of a pain going back and forth between your INI file and the emulator. Take your time and make sure to set all your controls correctly. Also, make sure to set the video to full screen. Go to video, select auto switch to full screen. And that's pretty much it. This tutorial shows you how to set up Sega Model 2 games on LaunchBox and also helps set up light gun games too. I love this set of games for Sega Model 2. House of the Dead, Gunblade, Dead or Alive, Virtual Cop, and Dynamite Cop. All great games to have on your arcade. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. Until next time, buckles. This is the Arcade Pirate sailing out.